thanks so much. And thank you all for being here tonight. This is, uh, this is a terrific turnout for such a wonderful organization that does so much with so little. The final award is for the Media Advocate of the Year. Florida's Children First recognizes the power of the media to reach thousands to educate the public on the needs of our children in care. Powerful stories can cause public outcry or a desire to improve the system. Our Media Advocate of the Year, Gia Tutelo Mote. Yeah, please come up here. Gia is an amazing woman who found her, her passion in promoting adoptions and fostering of children in foster care. She is an Emmy Award winning television producer and reporter who decided many years ago to leave her exciting job to become the founder and CEO of Forever Family. And she did this to focus on giving a presence to those in foster care who seek a forever family. She uses her talent experience and contacts in the industry to create news stories and on-air promotions highlighting children seeking adoption, teens aging out of foster care, and issues relating to foster care. Gia spends days with the children and youth getting to know them personally, understanding their dreams and desires. The dedication is just incredible because then she works with making them comfortable about sharing parts of their lives on TV and carefully edits the video so that the message is designed to engage and motivate the public to action. Gia works with her colleagues in major broadcast television stations to present the children's stories. To date, she's obtained over $30 million in free television airtime, donated to Forever Family. That's one person doing that much. And she does that to raise awareness about the foster care crisis and children awaiting families. Gia's efforts have helped over 1,000 children in their search for loving Forever Families. But the effects of these broadcasts go far beyond the individual children highlighted in the on-air productions. After a story airs, the lead agency in the area receives numerous calls from local residents motivated in finding out more about adopting children from care, becoming foster parents, or mentors, or guardians ad litem. And the audience for these stations is at over 40 million viewers per year. Look at the reach of that. That's just astronomical. People also call because they want to donate. Forever Family has collected over $1 million in cash and goods that have gone directly to families, teens aging out of care, and for critical items for our kids. NBC6, NBC6 is her South Florida television partner and is funded locally by the Children's Services Council of Broward County. Thank you. And of course, Gia's efforts have not gone completely unnoticed. She is already the recipient of many awards, and just a few. Emmy Award for Selling Innocence, a television promotional campaign which shed light, shed light on the child exploitation and the internet. Adoption Excellence Award for Media Public Awareness of Adoption by the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services and the Children's Bureau in Washington, D.C. The Congressional Award, Angels in Adoption, presented by the Congressional Coalition on Adoption Institute, Washington, D.C., and many more. So I could keep you here all night talking about all these awards. 
but I'm happy to add one more for you, Jan. Uh, in recognition for the amazing work done by you through Forever Family, by presenting you with FCF's Media Advocate of the Year Award. Indulge me one more minute, I'm going to read this to you. In recognition of your long-time commitment and passion to create forever families by promoting adoptions of children for foster care and encouraging others to become foster parents, and for showing that giving these children a face and a voice through the media makes an impact on public awareness and changes the lives of these children. Thank you so much for Thank you, Christina. Thank you, Gia. And congratulations for your awesome, awesome work. We're all big fans of watching you on NBC6. Thanks so much. Well, it's been a terrific night and a great ending to the program. If you guys enjoyed it and have been impressed with our guests and our awards tonight, we want to thank you for coming. As we thank you uh, for being here tonight, we want to remember that on your way out, that Florida Children, uh, Florida's Children First relies on your 